lovely people welcome back again oh. welcome back to my channel if you are seeing this channel for the first time hello this is mostly clear skin care here in this channel we bring you good quality content when i say good quality content we bring you nothing but the best we bring you detailed well researched content you know all right um if you are turning tuning in for the first time please subscribe to my channel like this video share comment and turn on your post notification bell so that you will not miss any of my uploads thank you very much for passing by if you are already a subscriber thanks so much okay um so many people do not know how to use caro white products or caro caro white cream okay there are some skins that when they use this caro white cream they tend to get green veins stretch marks white dots black dots and all that we have skins that when they use this cream they don't experience that those are the tough skins the tough skin or the the, the strong skin types so i saw a certain comment somewhere and the person was saying these people should stop um saying carol white gives green veins and i've used this carol right for five years and it's making my skin flawless i've not experienced any side effect yeah it's you some there are some skins that when they use this they don't experience any side effect those are the tough skins if you have a tough skin or if you have a strong skin those ones is is unlike it's unlikely that when you use these strong bleaching creams you get side effect a strong skin or a tough skin is those kind of skin that um nothing i mean nothing works on their skin though nothing nothing works on their skin but when they use the bleaching cream it works let's say if you have a tough skin i have a sister i have a, one sister she has a tough skin okay when she uses nivea jeggings dove lotions and all that she doesn't even see any effect she doesn't see any change nothing right but i have a combination skin when i use nivea fairness i see the change i see visible change i see that my skin is brightening good but when she uses um this kind of a uh, lotion egyptian uh, uh magic pattern lotion she saw change and then she didn't get any side effect from using that i will come and review on that very soon later in my uh, in my channel so if you have a tough skin and a, and a strong skin it's unlikely that you will get side effects from using strong bleaching creams but you still have to protect yourself you still have to um, put in anti-reaction product to um, prevent you from having all those kind of skin reactions just on the silver side okay now the sensitive skin and the um, combination skin oily skin and other skin type when they use strong bleaching products their skin gets to get uh, um, their skin tends to have side effect their skin tends to have green veins dark patches discoloration and all that so you may not know your skin type okay a lot of people they don't even know their skin type when you, you ask them what's your skin type they, they'll be like um yeah i don't know okay good if you don't know your skin type this is the right place for you this video is right for you i'm going to show you what you should add to your carotin cream so that you achieve a flawless skin tone okay you are not going to achieve any um green veins and all that and all those nyama nyama on your skin no no you're not going to achieve that i'm going to show you what to add okay so stay tuned and watch this video to the end please like this video share subscribe and um turn on your post notification bell all right so let's dive straight into this video this caro white cream is 120 ml it contains 120 ml and its main ingredients used for this cream is carrot oil or bitter carotene now this caro white lotion or this caro white cream we have the lotion and we have the cream yeah so you can use either the lotion or the cream just that the lotion is a little bit waterier than the um do we do we have anything like waterier <laughs> the the lotion is, is is a little bit watery than the cream okay so but because you are going to promix that's what i'm using 
um, the cream. Because if I use the lotion, it will become too watery on your skin. But if you prefer it that way, you can choose the lotion type. All right, so this, I'm going to use this Caro White Cream, what you're seeing on your screen. Now, the, what I said was uh, it's, its main ingredient is carrot oil. And it's, carrot oil is the same as bitter carotene. Bitter carotene is gotten from carrot oil. Now, this cream lightens your skin. When you use this for more than two weeks, for more than one month, this cream that is going to lighten your skin will whiten it. In my video, in my last, I think, video, I uh, made an upload of the difference between glowing, brightening, lightening, and whitening. Please, if you've not watched that video, kindly go and watch it so that you understand properly what I'm talking about. Okay, so this cream, when you use it for two weeks, three weeks, it's going to lighten up your skin. But when you use it for over a month, this cream is going to whiten up your skin. That means that it's going to alter your skin tone. If you are dark and you use this cream for two weeks, it's going to lighten up your skin tone. That is going to clear your um, hyperpigmentation, your dark spot is going to fade scars, your stretch marks, discoloration, and even out your skin properly. But when you use this cream for over a month, this cream will whiten up your skin tone. It's going to alter your skin tone. The, the, the next shade that you are going to get is nowhere near your natural skin tone. Alright? Good. So, it depends on you if you want to alter your skin tone, if you want to maintain your skin tone, if you want to lighten it up a bit. It, it solely depends on you. So, this cream... You are not supposed to use it alone if you have a sensitive skin or other skin types. Good. So I'm going to incorporate nice oils so that this cream or this pro mixing will um, even out your skin and make your skin flawless and radiant. Do you know olive oil? Olive oil. This olive oil, it's clock pores eh, it's very heavy on the skin so when i want to use it i don't use much yes yeah, so in this um, video i'm going to use just one tablespoon of olive oil you can use the goya olive oil or the um extra virgin any any good oil, olive oil you can get just use one tablespoon one tablespoon is 15 ml now after adding your one tablespoon of cover okay okay let me make it this way. Get your bowl, your sterilized bowl, or wash it very well. Pour in all your 120 ml of your caro white cream into the bowl. You understand? You are pouring all your 120 ml of caro white cream in your bowl. Okay. After that, add one tablespoon of your olive oil. You get it? Good. After that, you know grapeseed oil. Have you heard of grapeseed oil? Yes, you might have heard of that. Grapeseed oil is good for most skin types. It is lightweight, unlike other oils that clog pores in a heavy weight. This particular oil is lightweight, just like the sunflower oil. Good. You can even use sunflower oil or grapeseed oil. Yes. So, grapeseed oil is good for most skin types. Okay, it doesn't clog pores. It brightens up the skin nicely. Grapeseed oil is good for um, sensitive skin. If you have a sensitive skin, you don't know which oil to use, and you're afraid of your skin, you're afraid you get um, red, red skin and all that, use grapeseed oil. This grapeseed oil is very good for you, and it's good for acne-prone skin. If you have pimples, like, like anything you do, you are getting pimples. Hey, this issue. Hmm. I'll, I'm go, I'm going to upload a video on how to make a pimples product. Eh? I'll, I'll I'll upload it very soon. So kindly subscribe so that you will not miss any of my upload. Now, the, this grapeseed oil is good for acne prone skin. So this cream that you're going to use eh, on your skin is going to lighten up your skin. One, it's going to moisturize your skin. Two, it's going to clear all those kind of pimples on your skin you are going to add an anti-reaction oil don't worry that one too is not going to give you any side effects huh 
all right so grapeseed oil you are going to use 50 ml 50 50 ml of grapeseed oil you're going to pour it in your carotone cream so your carotone cream 120 ml your olive oil 15 ml 1 5 15 ml and then your grapeseed oil 50 ml 50 grapeseed oil 50 ml now coming to the anti-reaction oils coming to the anti-reaction oil this anti these oils they are not going to give you any side effects yes they are not going to give you any side effect they're going to protect your skin and going to prevent you from having any adverse effects from this promixing now our next oil is shalom stretch mark oil shalom stretch max oil Shalom stretch mark oil, you are going to use 30 ml. You are going to use 30 ml of your shalom stretch mark oil. Shalom stretch mark oil, as the name already implies, it protects your skin from having stretch marks. Okay? Good. And our last oil is one minute neem oil. Neem oil already protects your skin from um, 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 skin, uh, skin rashes, pimples, eczema, um, um, ringworm any skin issue at all neem oil is going to treat it okay good but don't use the neem oil use one minute neem oil neem one minute neem oil is a little bit it's it smells better than the um natural neem oil and it lightens up the skin they've incorporated other i mean active ingredient that helps the neem oil to improve upon its scent and it lightens the skin too so you're going to use one minute neem oil you're going to use two tablespoons that is 30 ml of your one minute neem oil so after that you're going to stir everything stir 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 you're going to stir everything mix everything you can use your hand mixer your hand blender mix up everything let everything incorporate well and then store it in your container all right store it in your container and you're done you're done no need to add vitamin e because this grapeseed oil that you've added 50 ml is going to moisturize your skin okay the olive oil too ouch i nearly hurt my so the the olive oil too is also going to what moisturize your skin so no need to add vitamin e oil <laughs> yes no need to add vitamin e oil you know me i like vitamin e oil most of my productions i add vitamin e oil to just moisturize your skin but the grapeseed oil and then the olive oil they are taking over yeah so that is it for today's video if you like this video hmm? like this video if you like this video like this video thumbs up to this video subscribe to this channel like this video like 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 this video so that any everybody will get a chance to watch this video thank you very much for watching this video to the end and see you in my next video bye